Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 35 in chapter 13. In chapter 13, we talked about fluids. In this system, you can see what quantity is given. V2 at this position 2, right? This is position 1, you can see. And then we need to find the velocity, uh, velocity for V1 for this liquid just uh, flow out. And Y2, Y1 is given. So now, how can we consider it? We can consider the continuity equations, right? So we can see the volumes of water moved just equal to the volume of water moved out from this position just equal to the volumes decreased at the position 2, agree? So now this one is A2, V2 equal to A1, V1, right? This is the continuity equation. So we can write the V2 in this function, put it there. And another thing is the Bolloli's equation. So at the position 1, we can write Bolloli's equation in this one. The P1, this is the situation in position 1 equal to situation in position 2. Now we can see both at the position 1 and the position 2, both of them connected with the air, agree? So that means the pressure is air pressure. The air pressure is P0, they are equal, so this term, this term cancels. Now we can solve the equation to find the V1, right? So we can change, transform this equation in this way. Now you can see we get the Y2 minus Y1 is H. This is given us H equal to Y2 minus Y1, agree? Yes, now we can solve this equation in this way, because now those, those cancels. So it becomes V1 square equal to V2 square plus 2GH. And input is a V2 inside, we can get as a function for V1, this one. Then it's proved. Thank you.